So, the question of the day is, who is the most dangerous avatar? Is this like a vote thing or- I want to hear what each of you think. And when we're finished, I've tallied up the votes from the video as you see here. And we can see who they think the most dangerous one of you is. Fair enough, I guess. Care to start us off, Cora? Sure. Wait, shouldn't I go first? Never mind. So, if we're talking dangerous, then I'm thinking Kiyoshi. Pretty self-explanatory. I killed Chin the Conqueror. I don't regret that at all. That's exactly my point. Touche. So your vote is Kiyoshi? There's just something about the thought of dying instantly if you get too close to her. I don't know. All right, then. Avatar Ang? Kiyoshi. Dude. No hesitation in that one, huh? Whenever Kiyoshi has a problem, she just automatically chooses violence. That is not true. Bruh. Kiyoshi, be real. I can hardly remember when you didn't choose violence. It just worked, man. It was part of my era. I stand by my decision. Whatever. Avatar Roku? Are you serious? Yes. Guys, what the hell? Kiyoshi, you killed a lot of people. So did Aang. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. All life is sacred. I hate you so much. Avatar Kiyoshi? You know what? I think it's Korra. Wait, what? That's surprising. In my opinion, you have the potential to be the most dangerous person here. Kiyoshi, are you serious? That's my answer. What's the problem? You know, I understand why those three would choose you, but I thought you, of all people, would notice the elephant in the room. I think I'm pretty justified in my choice. Don't get me wrong. Korra is a really strong fighter, but she doesn't have that mindset to be dangerous. Oh, so now we're talking about mindset? I love her, but Korra is always getting outmaneuvered or manipulated into situations where she's at a huge disadvantage, often at a great cost. If they fought me head on, I would have mopped the floor with every single one of them. Yeah, but they know that. And that's why you got put in such difficult scenarios. Whatever. Imagine you're discussing your great plan for victory amongst your allies and your greatest enemy is so far ahead of you that she's underneath the goddamn floorboards listening to your every move. Juan, I'm gonna have to ask you to wait your turn before talking about your choice. Thank you. Fine. Avatar Kuruk. Well, sorry, Kiyoshi. Are you joking? You can argue however you want, but no one else here would ever be willing to kill a mother and son besides you. I'd argue that's a new level of dangerous. That was one time. You're wrong, by the way. What? Kuruk, you're wrong. What? How am I wrong? I can recall a certain someone holding a mother of a newborn child hostage and threatening to blow up herself and the mother unless she gave her information. And once in your life, can you shut up? Young Chen, you didn't. She was laughing as she did it. Ang, listen to me, I can explain. She made the mother beg for her life. Well, that's spicy. She said when they both explode and die, it won't matter because she'll be reincarnated, but the mother won't. Yang Chen, what the hell? She rubbed it in her face that when she died, her child would most likely get raised by criminals and murderers. I, uh, I, uh, all life is... No, not now. Ang, I'm sorry. You don't get to say that anymore. But... But it's my line. But no, Cora hits really hard, so I guess that makes her the most dangerous, right? Oh my god, you are just like me, you absolute hypocrite. No, I'm not! Oh, you're right, actually. I think you might be even worse. Kiyoshi, you be quiet right now, I swear to god. Or what? You gonna try to make me beg for my life or something? Since you're so clearly into that? I'm not into anything! When she initially got the confession out of her, she didn't think her reaction was enough. So she sat there and made her beg even more. Juan, will you shut your goddamn mouth? And it's not even my turn, just you wait! The hatred I feel for you is so immense. Yang Chen, I'm going to need your answer. Cora. She, uh, threatened to murder a judge because of a rigged sentencing. That's pretty messed up, right? Are you trying to throw me under the bus? Yes. It didn't work. I know. You threatened to kill a baby's mother and enjoyed yourself while doing it. Nothing I've done has even come close to that. I mean, I gave her a choice. Oh yeah, tell me what I want to know or explode. Great options. I needed to know. You used reincarnation as a weapon. Who the hell even thinks to do that? Avatar Wan. Oh, where do I even start? Don't. Remember the time you almost lost control and nearly went into the Avatar state in an assembly hall and damn near killed everyone in the room? You know more than anyone else here why that almost happened. You're the only Avatar I can name that was actually tempted to stay in the Avatar state permanently. It just felt so good to have control of everything. That's not normal. It felt good to be free. Oh, and how did you learn all of those insane airbending techniques you use? Because I know damn well the nuns at the Western Air Temple didn't teach you that. Okay, Juan, enough. We're moving on to the votes from the comments. But I have so much more. You've made your point. Fine. You better die. Shout out to those 45 people. Oh my god. 700 votes for Yang Chen? Oh my goodness. Why am I considered the most dangerous I killed a single person? I don't think it's what you did do, it's what you could do. In that regard, I'm no stronger than Korra. Yeah. Last time I checked, Korra doesn't have the ability to delete someone's respiratory system at the snap of her fingers. I did that once. Could you do it again? 
Okay, yes, but 700 votes? You told a woman she was about to die and then laughed in her face when she begged you for help. Do you want my pure honesty? Her cries were music to my ears. I hated that woman. How are you an air nomad? Just, just how? One of her freak show combustion benders killed my bison. I would have died there with a smile on my face for all I could care. I didn't, I didn't know that. Yeah, all life is sacred until you fuck with a bison. Then that all kind of just goes out the window. Would you agree? Okay, maybe this one time you were actually justified. Yeah, you're damn right I was justified, so get off my back about it. Kurok went so goddamn hard against Father Glowworm that their fight nearly shattered a hole in the spirit world. I'm surprised he doesn't have more votes. I got over 300 people that know what's up. I'm all good, man. Oh, and I forgot to mention, but Zito got like 15 votes, by the way. <laughs> Good for him. He almost has as much votes as me.